Okay, so I'm ready. I'm gonna go to the zoo. The zoo in the Bahamas, which will be interesting. I've never been to another zoo outside my own country, so between me and you, I'm looking forward to seeing some gorillas. I haven't seen a gorilla close up. I saw the, the video on YouTube of a gorilla pounding on the glass and his kid was on the other side and it broke the glass. Yee. Yeah, hopefully that won't happen to me, but I won't be taunting the thing. That is to say, if it's even there in the first place, I might get there and see some animals which I've never seen before. That would also be a plus. But we're going to go there today. I'm going to record the footage on this camera. And yeah, let's get this show on the road. <laughs> Yeah, just, just live here? No. Isn't it? Yeah. Alright. Flamingo Arena, parrot feeding, restroom, snack bar, gift shop exit. I wonder if it's just flamingos here. I stand corrected. We have Jack Ooh, Jaguar. Coyote. Monkeys. This is a big place and I've got maybe I think two hours maybe an hour and a bit just to capture everything let's get a move on Ooh, what's this first animal of today is a bird which you can't see because my camera's not focusing on the bird just the cage rated PG-13 <laughs> Hey buddy, how are you doing? Ooh. Did you hear that? Did you hear that? Did you hear that? I swear it just said hello. 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 Maybe we're gonna walk away. Locals are gonna think I'm crazy talking to a bird. <laughs> Black Swan. We've never seen one of these before. Get close and look. It's like he's deliberately avoiding the camera and now he dunks his head down. There we go. Never, I didn't even think a black swan was real. I mean, you got the program, right? The TV show. Not TV show, the movie Black Swan, but. Hmm. Yeah. Is this a. He's seen us. I hear music, so I'm guessing that the flamingo party has started. <laughs> I did it again. 
I'm not going crazy. Say, say on camera, please say Hello. on camera. Yes. Hello. Hello. Got it, Sergey. Sergey. How rude. Just staring at the door. Right, so this is under construction, and I want to see the Jaguar. I'm not sure if that's in construction. I'm somewhere around here, and he told me to go this way, so he actually pointed me away from the Jaguar. So I'm wondering if I'm allowed to go there or not. Just to let you guys get a better perspective on the size of that thing. That's bigger than my dog. <laughs> Next one. Whoa, it's coming after me. It's running away. Oh yeah, this is some thing straight out of Jurassic Park. I want to talk about manifestation for a sec but more specifically how it happens in the sense that if you want to manifest a holiday and some stranger shows up there's a reason as to why they're showing up by that specific point in time for example Renoir I knew him two years ago he showed up, he was a student and I got to know him to the point where he invited me to his place in the Bahamas 
Now, I did have the intention to manifest things like this, these scenarios. As soon as I held this intention, that is when people started to show up. Now, if you just ignore these people because they don't look like the event that you want to manifest, it doesn't look like it's coming to fruition because you're blindsided, you think it should only be done one way, then of course, you're not going to manifest or you're not going to gravitate towards your intention. At least at the speed that you would have otherwise gravitated towards your manifestation if you had just remained open. We got someone coming up. Hello. Hi, Nathan. Doing good, thanks. Okay. So, yeah, that's what I wanted to say. Don't get too specific. Even if you don't know how something's gonna turn out, just roll with it, roll with whatever shows up, and see what happens. I promise you, you will not be disappointed. Yeah, that just happened. <laughs> so, the zoo was great. It was great. I, I wish there would have been bigger animals, but I guess I'll make do with what they had. And now I'm gonna eat this crunchy mix. Ingredients, add zuki beans, mung beans, green lentils, red lentils, and green peas. I'll put that in some sort of mix. And some orange juice. But yeah. That's today's vlog, guys. I wish I had more for you today, but I didn't do much today other than that. Now, I may have written some pages in the book that I'm working on, but other than that, that was it. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace.